Hey folks, back in the game here. Uh, I just went to Target. Uh, I was actually looking for uh, the new Allure Hockey uh, blasters that were supposed to come out today. Uh, I didn't find any, um, but I did find uh, two uh, 2023 Tops Update hanger boxes. Uh, I took a look at the boxes and I suspect that this is like the retail box that I opened the other day. And there are no um, Halloween slash orange and black parallels in here. Um, so it looks like those parallels are only available in the blasters. Um, I'm probably not going to open a lot of this product. This is probably going to be it. I've had pretty not great luck uh, on hanger boxes uh, for tops in general. Um, so I'm just going to open these, show you what's in them. I'm not sure I've seen a ton of videos of these being opened. Um, and then uh, we'll just, we'll call it a day. Uh, I, don't, I don't think there's a reason to be opening a ton of this. Uh, you know, I, I, I've almost got my set built. Surprisingly, I've opened two hobbies, four blasters, and a retail box, and I don't have the set built, which is a little frustrating, to be honest. Um, <clears throat> however, uh, if I'd have just bought a jumbo, I'd probably have the whole set, so uh, shame on me, I guess. All right, so as I recall, these hits are generally in the middle of uh, the uh, hanger boxes. So we'll see what we got. Maybe they're at the end. I saw something at the end there. We'll basically just run through these pretty fast. Um, you know, if you're interested in every little base card and rookie in here, certainly you can watch some of the other videos. I'd go through a little bit slower. All right, Gabriel Moreno, Tristan Casas, all sorts of, you know, good rookies in here. Um, most of them are the rookie debuts. There's not a ton of actual good rookie cards, um, straight rookies rather than the debuts. Um, but it's a, you know, it's a flagship set, so it's pretty cheap. So, all right, so we have an orange foil parallel coming up. I don't remember what that's numbered to. It is a Garrett Hill rookie card. That is to $2.99. That's not bad. Oh, I like that. Then we have a Royal Blue Parallel. These are not numbered for Jordan Walker rookie debut. That's a good one. Uh, and then we've got a backwards card here. Oh, okay. So that is a um, Rainbow Parallel. See, it's shiny and silver. It's hard It's hard to tell on camera, but it's it's shiny and silver and rainbowish rather than, um, you know, just the plain white. Then we've got uh, three... Four stars of MLB, which are pretty much worthless. Um, I mean, they're okay, I guess. Uh, and then we've got an All Aces. All Aces, Yuri Perez, rookie card. That's nice. I've never got a All Aces rookie before. Okay, I'll take it. Then we've got a Brandon Fott, uh, Pafat. I, I don't know how to say it. I was even watching the game last night, and I, I didn't catch it. Um, rookie card, 35th anniversary. Uh, I actually put a whole bunch of um, uh, Diamondbacks players, rookies, people that are doing well, cards online on eBay uh, last night right before the game, and I sold quite a few of them. So I think that's a pretty good indication that if people are watching the game and they're saying, hey, I, I like that dude, they're going to eBay and seeing if, if, uh, if there's any cards for sale. Uh, I didn't sell all of them. Obviously, I sell. I sold probably a, I don't know, a good thirty percent of them, which I think is pretty great. Uh, all those rookies, all the good rookies you're seeing in here, I'm I'm not pulling those out right now. I'm not really going to count those as hit hits, and I'm not counting stars of MLB as hits either, regardless of if anybody would really like me to, because those are. Uh, they're just oversaturated. There's too many of them, and there's way too broad of a definition of stars, and it just seems like a, I don't know, it's a weird, it's a weird thing to me. Uh, I hope they don't have those next year, to be honest. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and open this second box, and we'll see which one did better. I don't know that you're guaranteed anything in here. It says just look for relic and, and autograph cards, which... You know, all the boxes say that. Um, so I, I don't know what's guaranteed, but um, I, I don't think that was too bad, to be honest. That Jordan Walker Royal Blue is a 
if, if the Cardinals wore blue uniforms, that would be a fantastic hit. Okay. I'm, I'm not going to flip these upside down. It's, look at that. Is that Yuri? Oh, no, it's not. Okay. Thought it was the same guy twice. Uh, okay. So we'll just go through this, blah, 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 blah. Lots of good rookies. And here we go. We have a gold. So that is Brewer Hicklin, rookie card, numbered to 2023. That is 1226 of 2023. And then we have a Chrome, Stars of MLB Volpe. That's a good one. And another Chrome Bieber, not great. Uh, Braden Schumick. Schumick, I think that is, um, oh, it is a rookie card. All right, uh, and it is a rainbow parallel. And then we've got our regular uh, Stars of the MLB, Kodai Singa, uh, Grayson Rodriguez, Wilson Contreras, and Sonny Gray. Uh, then we've got time-spanning tandems, Jimmy Rollins and Trey Turner. I think I actually have that one. And then we've got a Masataki Yoshida 35th anniversary. And that is it. Unless we see something backwards, but I, I think it was if it was backwards, it would just be, uh, it would be in the middle with everything else. All right, so let's go ahead and go through the hits here from the two Tops 2023 update uh, hanger boxes. And here we go. The Masataki Yoshida 35th Anniversary, the Braden Shoemake uh, Rainbow Foil, the Chrome Stars of MLB Volpe, the Gold Hicklin, the Stars of MLB Brandon Fott, the Yuri Perez Rookie Card All Aces, the Rob Ref Snyder Rainbow Foil, the Royal Blue, or Royal Blue? I think it's, uh, I may be wrong on the, the name. I may have just forgotten it real quick there. Um, rookie card, rookie debut, Jordan Walker, and the Garrett Hill to 299 Orange. All right, uh, folks, thanks a lot. Have a good one.